Good evening, uh, good evening, good morning, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen from uh, Facebook and YouTube again. Today is March 27, 2020. Uh, here I am again waiting for this guy to open the gate for me. I'm going to share a little experience that happened to me yesterday. And I was thinking about it. Um, <clears throat> I didn't post the video, but I have the... the uh, I made I made a little bit, but I didn't post it. So here I am cutting the hooks, right? Trying to, you know, lay it out and cut the hook. So I'm about to break it. I'm about to just, just break it so I can uh, clean it up and uh, do the next one. <clears throat> I didn't have the right tool to do the job. I was using a break that it was just right there on the floor. I, uh... I went for the easy way out, the shortcut, you know, instead of going to my truck and grab the hammer and uh, do what I was supposed to do right from the beginning, which I was using the right tool. A lot of times, a lot of times in our life, we're gonna have situations I'm gonna compare what I'm, the experiences that I'm living with real life situations. Let's say you uh, you have a time of frustration, of uh, a bad moment with your family. It could be your mother, your wife, your kids, your friends, your husband, your sister. I mean, you can use this for for whoever is. Uh, you think it's gonna suit you and uh yeah sometimes you got frustration frustration and bad situation and and and, and uh, you get upset hey. uh what you do in this situation is uh, you use your words as a, as a tool <sighs> sometimes you uh just uh react right away stop start talking and say things that you were not supposed to say but you still do it anyway because it just came out of there you know you didn't think about it it was the easy way out and it was uh it was just in hand you know i'm gonna say this because this is what i'm feeling a lot of times when you already did it <laughs> you think about it and you say oh hold on I was supposed to use the right tool. I was supposed to say the right words. The outcome would have been different than what it is right now. So, what I'm trying to say is uh, sometimes you need to stop doing what you're doing. A lot of times, especially when you're not using the right tool to do the job, when you're not using the right words to speak because this is how I feel and this is how I'm going to do it and it's my life and, and I'm just going to let it out so it's not bothering me anymore. I want you to know how I feel. But you don't realize a lot of times you are hurting other people's feelings like your kids, like your mother, like your wife, like your husband, like your sister, like your best friend. Because you didn't care. You just went for the easy way out. Don't do it. Stop before it's too late. Grab the right tool, which is change the words on the way that you're going to say it. The situation might not change, but the outcome will change. It will be different. It will be better. <sighs> So I think uh, I think that's it. <laughs> I wanted to share this with you and uh, I hope you put this on practice because a lot of times we just go for the easy way out. We just grab that brake and start hitting the metal. The brake is uh, softer than the metal and the brake 
eventually it's going to break. But then when you use the hammer to hit another piece of metal, uh, you're using the right tool. The outcome is going to be different. And uh, for the same reason, the results are going to be different. The chances of you uh, hurting yourself or breaking that break or, or uh, I mean, it's just uh, there's no need for, for doing all that when you can just use the right words or use the right tool. To, 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 to change the situation. That's what I wanted to say. Have a good day and I'll uh, I'll keep making videos. Bye bye.